I think is one thing that makes it really, really difficult is the fact that you're away from your loved ones, from parents, from um, family, from friends, and you just only see them like once a year. If you have the occasion to see them. Hey guys, my name is Maddie and welcome back to my channel. Today I've decided to talk about me and to drag you a little bit in that category. Since I've moved to England, a lot of people from here, they've asked me what was the reason why I've moved here and how difficult it is. And I've decided to talk to you about it as well. I've moved to England four years and a half ago because of the obvious reason which is money i've learned english in middle school plus high school which is a total of about six seven years i guess films and music and all that kind of stuff it really helped me because obviously in school you just learn the basics and that kind of stuff we went to a shop to get a sim card because i needed like a like a telephone number and I remember that my husband, he was talking to the guy from the shop and he was like basically explaining to him how to activate the options and all that kind of stuff. When I have heard the first time an English person talking, I was, I was so anxious because I could not understand anything because of the accent and that really really put pressure on me and it really scared me a lot <laughs> when we moved here his auntie was basically living in just a one one bedroom flat and she was having kind of like a sofa that you can pull it but it was like a really really old sofa i remember the mattress was probably kind of like that and we were basically sleeping on the floor I was trying to find a job for two months I was going with the CV to every single shop in this town and I was applying online I was checking online I think I was on every single website I think is one thing that makes it really really difficult is the fact that you're away from your loved ones from parents from um, family from friends and you just only see them like once a year if you have the occasion to see them i feel like sometimes i'm a bit selfish <sighs> my mom and dad they are not here they are in my country and i've always been close to my mom and my dad it makes me it makes me feel selfish because I know that they are getting old and you never know what tomorrow brings and the fact that I'm seeing them just once a year um, it does make you it makes you realize how much you love them and how much you appreciate them I have some of my childhood friends that they got married, some of them they've got babies now and I haven't even seen them since I left it's, it's very sad it was very hard because I had to make new friends uh, I had to speak a language, totally different language I was scared and anxious but luckily I had people around me that they really really helped me they've been patient with me I only go back to my country because of my mom and dad and my friends I definitely have a better life here and because of that I don't think I could go back to my country unfortunately you shouldn't leave your country and you shouldn't leave your loved ones behind and you know it's difficult around holidays around my birthday because i'm quite um, sensitive soul and very emotional and i do get sometimes i get really really sad because of it and 
it's not healthy, but at the end of the day, I had I have to do what I gotta do. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comments down below. And if you enjoy this video, please don't forget to leave a little thumbs up, a share, and a subscribe to my channel. And I'll see you guys next Sunday. Thank you so much.